Well, more than a dozen Helena area law enforcement officers are back to normal duties after traveling in Great Falls this week to provide assistance around President Trump's visit. MTN's Jonathan Ambarian talked to some of the officers about their experiences. Great Falls was the center of attention this week as thousands of people arrived at Montana Expo Park for President Donald Trump's rally. A variety of law enforcement agencies came to assist local authorities, including a large contingent from the Helena area. One of the coordinators called to see if Cascade County was going to need any help, you know, with everything going on and volunteered our, some of our officers that were available. The Helena Police Department and Lewis and Clark County Sheriff's Office sent 15 members of their civil disobedience team. They're trained for crowd control and other issues at that type of large event. We just went up and provided assistance pretty much everywhere and anywhere we were needed. Some of the officers worked on the lines as people waited to enter the Four Seasons Arena. Authorities say about 6,000 people watched President Trump's speech. Several thousand more weren't able to get seats inside. For that amount of people being that hot, as you can imagine, standing in the heat like that for hours and hours, tempers tend to flare, but I didn't see much of that. Everybody was really calm and very nice to work with. Senior Deputy Don McCarthy and other officers were also called on to separate anti-Trump protesters and supporters after some heated confrontations between the two groups. A lot of chanting. I actually didn't even hear many people cussing. It was, it was pretty mellow for what it was. Um, a lot of opinions being thrown around, but it was fairly calm. Officers say overall they believe the event went smoothly. They say they're thankful they were able to be part of it especially being law enforcement in Montana, you don't get that opportunity very often to be that close to the presidential party and all the constituents and everything that comes along with it. As a law enforcement officer, getting that opportunity to be a part of that is, is awesome. In Helena, Jonathan Amberian, MTN News. The Civil Disobedience Team is a joint operation between the police and sheriff's offices. It includes around 20 officers from the two agencies.